I'm really happy to welcome our uh, Yasaki delegation here with me. We are on the conference solar heating and cooling in uh, Istanbul and you traveled from very far away. I think Yasaki is a very well-known company for chillers in the world. And I would like to know, first introduce Mr. Yasuhide Ishida. I think you are from R&D in the headquarter in Japan. What you made you travel all this way to Germany, uh, to Europe? So as as you know, the in, um, in the world there has the problem of the global warming or a lot of energy problem. So and especially the uh, these days the electricity consumption is almost dominant in the world, and the heat is uh, less uh, interesting. So we as the Yazaki 40 years experience in the heat uh, energy business, we would like to introduce ourselves to more uh, dedicated on the heat energy for the uh, world um, world energy saving. So that is the main purpose we are here. Well, I think you have uh, already sold enormous numbers of absorption chillers, like several ten thousands in the world. How about solar? Is it a big business for you? Uh, actually, solar business is also one of the interesting parts. But uh, as I mentioned, uh, the heat is our concern. But just for the number, we already installed 378 units uh, for all of the world. That, uh, that is our uh, the footprints, but we would like to also improve uh, these numbers to, uh, to use the renewable energy in the world. Excellent. I think you are already in the third generation of your chillers. Can you tell us a bit more what you are still improving in a product which is already several centuries in the market? So for the absorption chillers, uh, the, the weakness is that uh, still uh, we are thermal driven chillers, but they're still using some pumps. That means electricity. So we are planning to reduce this um, uh, pump electricity consumption drastically to improve our performance. So that is one of the purposes for the fourth generation. And we would like to uh, develop the really drastic change within five years for the fourth generation of Substantia. Well, hello. Also welcome to Mr. Wai Seng. I think you are based in China and you are developing the market in China. It's the hugest uh, solar thermal market worldwide. What, uh, well, what chances do you see in this interesting market? Okay, so the China is uh, for the solar thermal. Now it's uh, the biggest uh, market in the world. So uh, China has uh, occupied almost 80% of the solar thermal market in the world. But most of the applications in the domestic hot water applications. So, and in recent years, Chinese market is shrinked in somehow because of the, the applications already limited in the uh, hot water uh, heater. So the Chinese manufacturers and interests for solar thermal, they are seeking the new applications uh, as for the industrial processes and also solar cooling. So Yadaki is now is going to the Chinese market to help Chinese solar thermal industries to get a new start. Thank you very much. I would also like to introduce Mario Kolayema. I think you're responsible for the European market of Yasaki and you are based in Italy in a joint venture which is called Maya. Can you tell us a bit more on the standing of a Japanese company in this chiller business in Europe? Well, uh, we started uh, uh, many years ago uh, distributing uh, uh, Yasaki chillers in, uh, in Italy. And uh, um, so we did the very first installation in solar cooling in back to the end of the 70s. So we are talking about uh, almost 40 years ago. And uh, we look forward to, to the introduction of the new products in the in worldwide, and especially in Europe, uh, because we would like to offer new proposal to the, to the markets of uh, solar cooling. Thank you. Excellent. I want to thank you for your commitment in solar in general as a company and also to this particular conference. And you wish you a very nice day. Thank you much to, to all of you. Thank you.